My ex-housemate Hogs, he comes to the show with inventions. Um, a lot of emails saying, where's Hogs been? We, he needed some time off. He did. The last invention I think we had was the skin-coloured phone. <laughs> skin-coloured phone. So cops can see you if yeah. you're on the phone. Yeah, yeah. That, he did He did say, look, this is one... That wasn't, that wasn't one he picked. That was on the list of things going, no, that's yeah. been scrapped. And it's good because it shows that there is a cull before mm. these ideas reach us. This isn't just Hogs plucking thoughts out of midair. Mm. He, you know, there are some that don't make the list. Mm. I think that was in the same pitch as the elastic hoop that you like, the rubber band that goes around your head and your phone like dangles by the side of your Which face. Which did have sound effects on it. So if if you wanted to pretend you were at the Formula One Grand Prix, you could put Formula One sound effects in the background. And that was a specific example given to us. <laughs> I mean, you could have had thousands of different sound effects on there. He joins us uh, right now. Hogs, are you there? Gents. Oh, drop the whistle for 09. <laughs> <laughs> what, what happened to the trademark Hogs whistle? Oh, I'm just straight into business. <laughs> <laughs> but Hogs, an important part of business is having a trademark. <laughs> All right, start again. Start okay, again. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, Hogs, are you there? <laughs> there he is. <laughs> <laughs> Hogs, this is exciting. You, you demand. You were worried after last week's invention was done that um, that you, you wanted a bit more time off. Yeah. Uh, this is a couple of weeks ago. Sorry, before we even went on the tall ship adventure. Um, yeah. How have you felt over the last two weeks for inventing? Mate, I. I, I uh did the exercise I've gone because what I do I highlight in yellow what I actually have already proposed to you guys from, yep. from the list and from the I've, I've proposed 13 ideas yeah really from, from that 13 ideas yep. 10 of those 10 of those ideas have already been invented yeah <laughs> yeah two ten, one of them was uh, one of your listeners just copied off me, which was uh, weather bets. I couldn't start that up. Stole it, yeah. And then, stole it, yeah. And then the other two, you guys just thought was so stupid that I shouldn't invest myself. <laughs> <laughs> well, I had, to, I had to blow at some stage, and I did, and I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You did, Hogs. It was. A, it's it was nice a, to have you back. But it was good. I mean, do you feel that the break is? Uh, you know, have you have you been thinking a lot more in the break now that your mind's got a rest? Or oh, the the list is growing a lot stronger, but, and uh, I'm I'm confident this year. Yeah, now, now, people, when Hawks talks to the list, he has a, a, a Excel spreadsheet that is on his desktop where he works as a kid's book salesman. And that's what I mean, he adds you, to the idea. You'd have, a, you'd have to have a lock on your computer, Hawks, in case people... <laughs> what if people tried to break in and, you know, steal your ideas? Yeah, oh, well, I, just, I just hope that doesn't happen. <laughs> I, haven't, I haven't done anything to prevent so far, but good idea. Okay. <laughs> there we Hawks. go, one for me. Hawks, <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's hear your invention this week. People at the ready on 131060 if you're willing to invest or question the invention of Furthermore. Hawks, go take it away. Yeah, this week's um, it's called Photo Bet. Photo um, <laughs> That's So if you want to weather, weather bet, you bet on the weather. Photo Bet. You bet on the photos, right? What do you mean you bet on a photo? <laughs> so what happens? You go on to, to photo bet, and there, and you might want to place a twenty dollar bet. <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? How do you bet on photos? Hang on, just hang on. Okay, okay. sorry, sorry. So two photos flash up: a man and a woman, which is you know the couple, or yeah. the husband and wife yeah. flash up, yeah. and then. Ten kids flash up underneath, and it says, "Right, this this couple has three kids. You have to pick the three kids." And so you might go, "All right, he's got their nose, you know, he's got the you know the smile there," <laughs> and it's you know like ten to one to pick all all the three kids. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And then there's different odds for how many. So it's basically <laughs> <laughs> this is just betting on anything. <laughs> Just no, it's not made bet. It's photo bet. Yeah, but you could have a website where you just bet on anything. <laughs> then you could have you could have colour bet, and you go if you mix all these together, what what colour do you reckon you can get? You could have that... ant bet. <laughs> Wh- which ant will the ant eater eat in this short video? Why? But that maybe that's a new ex- ex- exception for if this is photo bet. You can do anything now. Hawk... I think photo bet's a lot stronger than all that stuff. <laughs> ben on thirteen ten sixty. Ben, you have a question for Hogs. Yeah, I'd just like to know, Hawks, um, what if the parents have stepchildren or adopted kids? Do the odds go up or do they go down? <laughs> Good question. Well, they go up, obviously, but you, that, that's a different bet altogether. <laughs> that's another idea. That's not a different part of the uh, photo bet, but you could just see your photo bet platinum where you really have to be good because they're adopted kids, so there's no way by, you can tell by looking at the kids. Morgan, on 131060, you're a 12-year-old Morgan. Yep. You've got a suggestion to improve photo bet. 
Yeah, I think that a way to make it better could be if you make it a scratchy cut or something like that, and then you tick the boxes of who you think the children are. Okay, okay, so it's a scratchy here, but so 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 Morgan, I'm I'm as confused about yours as I was about Mel. I think I think hey Morgan, let's just You're try and, confused, mate. let's just try and figure it out on the online form first, which is highly flawed, and yeah. then we'll 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 franchise into scratchies. <laughs> but thank you, Morgan. Dale, it won't yeah. work. You think? No, I think I found a flaw. Okay, well, I don't think... Really? Okay. Right, because with horse racing, when you're betting, at least you see who wins. Yeah. But with these parents, the side could just make up whether the kids are theirs or not. There's no actual proof unless you've got the parents there saying... Yeah, they're my kids. So you think that uh, betters will be... Um, the problem is, Hawks, with everything you gamble on in life, there is proof. Yeah, and you're, yeah. you're worried that Hawks, being the kind of owner or, and obviously the runner of this website, he might just make up uh, where the kids are, are attached to different parents. Exactly. Hawks, how would you deal with that? Well, what about pokies? Po- there's no proof in pokies. That's a good so point. That's, well, that's there is. If it, comes up, if, it comes up, if it comes up three cherries, you have to get the money you, you bet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but this, I'm not going to lie. Like, well, <laughs> well, you do need to do a bit better than that. You can't just giggle and then say I'm not going to lie. Do you see? Do you see what he's pointing though, Hawks? Because it's sort of like with pogies or with tat slotting, You know, you're watching the balls being drawn out, so you know for a fact whether you won or not. You're not just going, my numbers were this. Did I win? And the guy's saying yes or no. <laughs> but I think obviously but- the government board would go around Hawks and check up on you. Yeah, uh, and and you can sue if you want, but I will. <laughs> it's not as catchy as life could be a dream, but you can sue if you want. Might be a good tagline for photo bet. Hogs, I I I have I regretfully announced that there is no positive callers. <laughs> For the first time ever in all of your ideas, there is, in fact, not one positive caller, not one person willing to invest. And this is after two weeks off, I remind you. Not one. Not no, one. No, not I'll one. My mum didn't even call up. No, there's a guy called Dan, and it's simply written alongside his name, horrible, horrible idea. idea. We won't even take Dan's call because he might be so angry at you <laughs> for having that idea. Hogs, if you were playing the game right, and you'd bet 100 bucks, and you said, I reckon these three kids were the ones, right? And then it came up and said, oh, sorry, you're wrong. It was these three. How would yeah, you feel? Yeah, and then they'll go, oh, yeah, yeah, look at his nose, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but if you, if you just, if one came up and it was just completely didn't look anything like the parents, would you go, well, how do I know the site's not rigged? Bet again. Bet, Bet again! <laughs> <laughs> Try and win your money back. Thank you, Hawks. <laughs>